Chev, we didn't do Chris Brown. Let's do it. Ready? Here we go. Friends, Chris Brown looked like he was in love with you. Really? I didn't think it was all like that. The way he was touching you was so crazy. I was like, I should have done it. But you know me, like I have a, I have a boyfriend, so I don't think he would like that shit. Oh. Oh yeah, I'm, I'm with Fedor right now. Bye. Wait, what did you do last night? I went out with my friends. Chris Brown's concert. Yeah. <laughs> you guys didn't do the meet and greet, did you? Did you take a picture with him? Oh, if I go on Twitter right now, I'm not gonna see anything, right? I'm not gonna see him grabbing your ass cheeks, am I? <laughs> <laughs> Because yeah. if that happens, I'm breaking up with you, Hope. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was a decent deal. Because it's like we're meeting. A decent deal? A thousand dollars? You're overreacting. I'm overreacting. You don't provide for him, but not provide for me? Ask, hey, can we go 50 50 on the rent? And you, you got mad at me. I didn't have enough for rent this month. Clearly, because it all went to freaking Chris Brown. When I ask massage, I massage right now for free. <laughs> Yo, every every time we do this, it is the most insane shit I have ever seen. It's not. Listen, if you guys want to fuck Chris Brown on the DL and backstage, whatever. Like, at least have the decency to keep it a secret. To have a boyfriend and to actually pay twelve hundred dollars to Chris Brown to have him grab your ass in a photo. Do you think, like, what is the percentage of these women who aren't using their boyfriend's credit cards to pay for this in the first place? It's absolutely fucking madness. Well, yeah, that people would keep doing this, and he's saying the same thing. It's like, I'll give your ass massage for free. I would not break up with her. Are you kidding me? That's yeah. nuts. <laughs> anyway, anybody here want a, a photo of Chris Brown? No? 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 You wouldn't pay for it? No, thank you. <laughs> uh, Scott, Scotty would. Scotty would do it. Scott will do anything. <laughs> I agree with the dude. What do you think about sense. this phenomenon of everyone taking pictures with Chris Brown? I think it's, it's fuck all. Like, and it's okay if you're a single girl, but if if you have a boyfriend, it's disrespectful. Is, is it okay if, if, if you're a single girl and I saw a picture of Chris Brown picking you up in his hands on your ass? You do understand. Like, yeah. you are for recreational use only. True. Forever. Yeah. Like, bro, there's no 100%. way. Because here's the thing. If Chris Brown hits that girl up, there is no way you pay a man $1,200 you wouldn't fuck. There's no yeah. way if Chris Brown hits up. Chris Brown has hit up two of my clients' girlfriends <laughs> this month. <laughs> I'm not kidding, bro. This month, you're, you're telling me uh, like he's almost as bad as Tyga. Tyga's the worst. Tyga literally, mm. anybody got a, a message from Tyga? I want to do a, a, a video shoot. You I got met, one too? I met him at Rhino. Yeah, every tiger, every every <laughs> every girl I know is like, oh, we're gonna do a video shoot, whatever. Like, like, but what I'm saying yeah. is, what I'm saying is like your girl is like maybe she doesn't have the opportunity to fuck Chris Brown, but that's only because he only has one dick. That's the only reason why. Yeah. Like, if Chris Brown wants to fuck your girl and she paid twelve hundred dollars to take a picture with him, she's gonna fuck Chris Brown. I don't know if you guys understand how math works, but that's the way it works. <laughs> and she used your money, she used your money to take that photo. Anyway, what do you no, think? No, 100%. Right? Um, I've got two rules, simply. If, if let's say I'm out with a girl that I'm dating and they meet a celebrity. So I've dated a couple of girls who are friends with celebrities back in India and they're like literally friends. So this one time we were out at a club and there was one, one dude, like very famous sports guy in the club. And she's like, oh, baby, let's go meet him. Let's go say hi. And I don't know the guy. So I told her, all right, we'll go. But I've got two rules. One, you do not take a drink from him. And secondly, we do not sit down at the table. The reason being, if... We go out there and we sit down at the table. The two of them are sitting down there and I'm out here just sitting like this. Now they start talking and I look like a little bitch. I'm not going <laughs> to, I'm not going to let that happen. And then if she wants a free drink, she's out with me. I can get her that. No fucking taking free drinks from anybody else. So we went up to the guy who was really, he was really cool. She didn't take a drink. We didn't sit down. We spoke to the guy. All good. But if this would happen, dude. I'm back in Vegas again, and I'm burning the town yeah, down. <laughs> yeah. Remember, yeah. So what, if this happens, let, let no. go. Okay, so what is the difference between your girlfriend paying twelve hundred dollars for a photo of her and Chris Brown, and someone coming here and paying twenty dollars, your boyfriend, with a picture of one of the last Vegas showgirls on Fremont Street? Because it's on the down low. Oh, you mean for a photo? Yeah, with them, because they because do the because same she, exact he's, not, thing. he's not groping her. Ass, yeah, yeah, and she wouldn't. The dick him. isn't being he's grabbed. He's absolutely grabbing him. They're like lifting. Yeah, like if, then it's a problem. You're, if, oh, yeah, no, you have a point. If your dude is taking photos, grabbing another girl's ass yeah. and paying her for it, yeah, that's disrespectful. I don't disagree with that. Same thing. It's just a price. Yeah, but the point. difference. The difference is Chris price Brown. Point, if Chris yeah. Brown wanted to fuck, she would. That showgirl doesn't want to fuck some dude who paid. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. I know. Shout out to Carly. Shout out. There's like we got like ten of these girls on the show. Yeah. There is no if way. If she texts him, hey, what are you doing? No, no, no. Today? Of course he would fuck. Of course he would. I'm not saying that. So, Men in general. And they do that here so, 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 if you and me are on the strip and there's the 
the the, the showgirl chicks We're there. Free yeah, and if I say, hey, uh, give me twenty bucks so I can go and grab this girl's ass, that's a little bit different than than going out there and doing it for yourself. Because remember, yeah. remember, it's my pay, twenty bucks. It's, it's not your twenty bucks. Yeah. Mm. It's that the the, diff, the worst part about this is not twenty bucks. It's a thousand, yeah. and it's not her money. Okay. It's his money, dude. Ladies, the the moral of the story: if you're gonna cheat, do it on the fucking DL. That's all I'm saying. Isn't that the point? That's the right. And it is Chris yeah. Brown who beat the living shit out of Rihanna. Yeah. How does, hey, every, <laughs> how does Chris Brown ask a girl on a date? Oh, <laughs> Sorry, my bad. We just got canceled. <laughs> and canceled. I agree with the dude, though. For sure. no, I was going to say. So, I mean, I, I get what you're saying, and I kind of understand what he's saying to you. Yeah. But, um, like, have you seen those pictures? And I know some of the guys in here have seen those pictures where, like, these these couples will go, kind of nerdy couples will go to Comic-Con, and Jason Momoa will be there. And he'll be, he'll take pictures for free, right? Except for he'll be pushing the boyfriend off like this, and he's grabbing the girlfriend over here, and the boyfriend, and the boyfriend, and like that's it's basically you know stiff arming the guy out of the picture kind of thing, and it's funny, <laughs> and everybody laughs, and all her girlfriends love it because it's freaking Jason Momoa, right? But it's like it's the same dynamic. It's like like just what he's saying. It's yeah. like I'm not letting that happen. Do you do? Oh, I'm not letting understand that Jason Momoa isn't doing that because he's an alpha. He's doing that because he yeah. believes in beta ideology, yes. which is that women should be able to do that, and it should yes. be a problem. Yes, yes. I mean, because yes. like he. He's not doing it to flex. Right, right, but my, yeah, my point yeah. is Jason Momoa then would not trip if Chris Hemsworth was hooking, was hugging his girlfriend right. because he's supposed and to push him out. Because the that's picture, what yeah. the that's what Joy Behar and Whoopi, Whoopi Goldberg and Sadia <laughs> Khan told him to be cool with. <laughs> yeah. Not Sadia Khan, so that's a bad example. But that, like basically blue pill ideology is you're supposed to be cool with your girl flirting. Stop being so insecure, bro. It's not that big of a deal, bro. It's fine. He just grabbed her ass. Why are you being – that's small dick energy. It's not a big deal that Chris Brown the grabbed her ass. He paid $1,200. You should be cool with that, bro. What's the problem? Stop being so fucking insecure. That's – because he lives in that woke world, what, living in Hollywood, that's why he did that shit. It's not because mm -hmm. he's trying to flex on the dude. It's because you're because the dude is supposed to be okay with that. Mm -hmm. I'll also say this, and more to your point, okay? <laughs> and I know, no, I know Jake's in here somewhere, but if you're going out with a girl and a girl says, hey, let's go see this really killer band tonight at this club, mm -hmm. so I know the drummer, we can get in, right? She's plucking the drummer. She is every single time. It's like she knows somebody in the band to get into the mm -hmm. to get into the venue. Yeah. She's fucking or has fucked somebody in that. Yeah, band. possibly, but like um, she's she's around those people, not not because she's around, it's mm -hmm. like since she was a child. Her parents have had access to those scenarios, and that's why she's met them. So that so that dude that she wanted to meet was literally a friend from childhood. He he it wasn't like he got famous. Oh, you're talking about your situation. My We're situation, confused. 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 like yeah. my situation. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Okay, let's do this one. Click the link in the description, and I'll send you an exclusive invite to my elite networking community, where you can learn to date high quality women today.